Hi, I'm Jean Marklin. I live in Williamstown, Massachusetts. I grew up in Wontaw on Long Island in New York, so you may hear a bit of my accent coming through. My quilt national piece is titled Tree Wounds, and it is 48 inches high by 46 inches wide. The repeated image is from a tree in Dublin, Ireland. I lived there for a few months in 2009, and I saw this tree wound on the tree every day that I passed it, and I photographed it a lot of those days. I felt that the tree was looking right at me, and it was saying, help, please. We are being burned up, cut down, and we can't survive this climate. Please save us. It really struck me very deeply to feel that the tree was communicating with me. And it has stayed with me for 12 years. I photographed hundreds of other tree wounds and I'm always on the lookout for ones that particularly are rememberable. Um, those that look right at you, that feel like they're looking right at you in particular. I struggled with how to put this piece together for a long time and ultimately decided that using repetition and jewel tone colors were what would best suit the image and the tree. I've been influenced by Nancy Crow and Jan Myers Newberry. I think in both their use of color, especially jewel tones, and repetition, I felt ultimately that it was the best way for me to show homage to this tree wound. The piece is um, printed on my hand dyed fabrics in my studio, fused, and then machine quilted. I've made other pieces in this series, uh, mostly smaller ones and some very small. It took me a while to figure out how to have the piece have the impact I hoped it would have. That impact is to call to you and have you say, we really do need to pay attention to the environment and I can make changes in my life to help that. Also that you do what you can and you also vote for people who put the environment at the top of their agenda. As an undergraduate, I studied film and photography. I worked as a photojournalist for seven years, mostly in Washington, D.C., and loved that I got to create photos every day, mostly of politicians, um, writers, actors, celebrities, whatever, as well as the um, everyday people who do most of the work that keep our country going. I have been a hobby photographer since the 1990s. I went to graduate school for social work and was a clinical social worker doing therapy with children and families. Uh, I discovered quilting in a traditional class and realized that it could feed my creative energies that I didn't have anymore since I wasn't working as a photojournalist. And it eventually distracted me so much from my work as a therapist that I decided to give that up and pursue it full time. So I have been an art quilter for about 20 years. I am so excited to be part of Quilt National 21 it's my first acceptance to the exhibit, and I feel so honored to be a part of it with all the other excellent artists in the show. 
I thank you for coming to this video and watching it and giving me your time.